But if you only bring, bring a contractor and build a few RDP houses in an area which is traditionally rural, then we fail to understand where the community comes from and how it is lived. Our, the question we have to be able to answer in this community is, how can we facilitate the development that might mean change? that could involve the community involved in the construction of their own houses. Because the land issues in Mamre have been different. And so why should the construction not be different and why should we not use the subsidy from government differently? These are the things that you can do if you have a democracy that cares about people, that listens to people, that understands the interests of people. And so my plea to you today and I'm saying I'm doing it on my own behalf, I'm doing it on behalf of the ANC National Executive Committee, <coughs> but I'm also doing it on behalf of the President who wanted to be here with you today. My plea to you today is to let's go out, convince every citizen of Mamri to register, and then we will convince them why they have no choice but to vote ANC. That's a statement of confidence, but if you don't have confidence, you, you don't deserve the support and the mandate. We're tegen dat we geen kiezen hebben om ANC te stemmen. Hulle moet ANC stemmen. Maar als hulle niet geregistreerd is, nie, al is hulle stemgerechtig, dan zal hulle ons hulle niet kan oortegen. Nie. Ons moet vandaag van hierdie geleentheid gebruik maken om zeker te maken dat die meeste mensen in hierdie dorp eindelijk geregistreerd is. En dan zal ons hulle wees wat democratie betekent. Dan zal ons hulle wees wat zelfvertrouwen betekent. Dan zal ons hulle wees wat het betekent om te luister naar die behoeftes van ons mensen, van ons van de democratie bouw, wat sterk is, wat diep is, wat langdurend is. Een democratie wat, wat klem leidt op de verbetering van ons levensgehalte. Dit is wat ons moet doen. En ik vraag jullie elke keer om anders te oortuig om te registreren voor dag. Amandla. Thank you, Comrade Manuel. I think uh, the, 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 the Comrade Trevor have addressed and actually kept us glued to our seats in terms of, of his input and, and, and the truth that, that he actually said and projected on behalf of the ANC, the President, and, and, and the whole country for that matter. Comrades, uh, Comrade Manuel was our last speaker, I believe. If I can just have uh, the, 